Hey guys, I just wanted to make a quick video uh, about the GPEC 2A unlock. So all the people that are using the OBD SAR um, DC 706, this is kind of going to be a surprise to you guys. Uh, but I just downloaded the newest uh, software update and look what they gave us. Unlock ECU. Now, there's only one thing that that tab could mean, right? We're not going to have to do the hocus pocus with transferring to a USB and putting the hex file on our computer and editing it or scrolling all the way down to the lines and making manual edits to unlock it for tuning. I'm assuming that they are going to provide an unlock for it. So we're going to see if that unlock works with HP tuners. So we're going to hold this little guy right there. We're going to connect. I'm just reading the internal flash in case we have any issues. I doubt we will, but just in case. All right, we got that saved. Unlock ECU. Let's see what happens. Alright, it just finished uh, doing its unlock. Wants me to save this. I guess we'll put unlocked. Disconnect from it, and we'll take it over to HP Tuners and see if it worked. All right, we got it uh, plugged in here with the HP Tuner connected. I already did a read of it. Uh, this one's needing a, a MDS delete, so I went ahead and did that. We're going to see if it writes. It did not unlock the ECM. All right, we're back here again. Um, I took it off, went to HP Tuners, and it did not unlock it. So I'm thinking that after we hit unlock ECU and it had to save that other file, I'm thinking that we need to write that as the internal flash. So let's go find that file. My bad. There it is. All right, for some reason I couldn't find the file. 
So I'm just unlocking the ACU again and uh, we'll use that file directly once it's done. All right, this time, for whatever reason, it didn't ask me to save a file, but it says ECU, gosh dang it, ECU unlocked, finished. So we'll try it again. All right, I'll hook back up again. Same thing. Okay, we're back. Since I never read directions and I'm always so rammy, I of course, you know, didn't read the guide. I just jumped right in and did what I wanted to do. Uh, after reading the guide, you have to do the unlock in boot mode. So that means using the P004 adapter and also putting this resistor in right there. It's a thousand ohm resistor. And so there is a trick. Usually you'll hit connect on this and it's not gonna read. Most likely this is not gonna go. I'd be super surprised if it did. What the trick is, is once you hit connect, and you see this little car right here blink a couple times. Then you reach over here, turn it off, on, and then it should go. So we're gonna try it. Here, I'm actually gonna scoot this over so you can see what I'm doing at the same time too. Connect. I got it. See how it did It did its first like three blinks up there, went black. I turned it off, turned it on, and then it went solid. And then it's writing the bootloader. Otherwise, I think I tried, I counted the other night, maybe 10 times I tried. And it finally went without doing that. All right. So... We're going to go ahead and do unlock ECU. Okay, it is asking me to now save this after I did the unlock. So I guess we'll just name it, uh, let's see, zero, so it'll probably come up first. Okay. Okay. This file name. The file name of you enter already exists. Weather covered. What in the hell is that supposed to mean? Yes, I guess. So I don't know, right, internal flash. Let's see if that actually saved. Well, it didn't save anywhere in here anywhere. I don't know where it went.
And it's not in the hex editor either, so it's not like it's open. Hmm. Well, should we just unplug it and plug it into HP tuners and see if it worked, I guess? All right, we're back here to test it again. Same thing, still locked. Incompatible PCM software. All right, we're just gonna go ahead and load a file that I manually load external data. Okay, okay. One that I manually unlocked. Oh, you piece of crap. Right here, manually unlocked it. All right, that manual file is written in there. And a disconnect. I'm going to unhook this. Hook up the HP tuner. Give it some power. Hit right. Oh, forgot to take this little guy off. Imagine that. It works when I do it manually. So I don't know what OB OBD Star has going on, what the unlock does, but it sure as shit doesn't unlock it for HP tuners. <laughs>